Hello and welcome to Zoo La La. We're here in the belly of Bristol City Museum to ask the question, why are eggs so, well, egg-shaped? At just over a centimetre, this hummingbird egg is one of the smallest in the world. But weighing in at a monstrous 1.5 kilograms, the ostrich egg is the largest. So there's something with this eggy shape that makes it a winning formula, but what is it? There are a number of different theories. Theory number one is about keeping warm. That eggy shape allows them to fit tightly together in the nest, minimising the air gaps in between. Several ground nesting birds lay their eggs like mini pyramids with a sharp point to one end. This allows three to four eggs to fit snugly together in a nest so that mum can keep them warm more efficiently. So why else would a bird want to lay an egg-shaped egg? Theory number two is all about safety. Eggs are often laid in precarious locations and one small knock can send them tumbling to the ground. But that special egg shape means they tend to roll around the inside of the nest rather than fall off the edge. Many cliff nesting birds have taken this to the extreme. Razorbills and guillemots lay extremely conical shaped eggs, meaning they roll in a very tight circle, keeping them on the cliff and not in the sea. In contrast, many birds who nest in burrows or cavities lay more spherical shaped eggs, like this tawny owl egg laid in a tree hollow. There's little chance it's going to roll into the path of danger. So not all eggs are egg shaped. Extremely small birds like the hummingbird lay elongated eggs. These small birds have such a tiny pelvis, they simply couldn't lay a large round egg. Yet there has to be enough substance inside the egg to ensure the survival of the embryo, so they they simply lay a long narrow egg. Theory number three might come as a bit of a surprise. It's all about strength. Grr. Eggs have no sharp edges, which means they can withstand more force than you might imagine. Most structures break at their corners and edges. These points concentrate the force into one area, and this can lead to disaster. It's the same reason a piece of paper is relatively easy to tear apart when there's a rip already in it. The force is concentrated around the tear, making it really easy to rip apart. On the other hand, if any force is placed on an egg, it's evenly distributed across the whole surface. There is no one area for it to concentrate. In fact, the shape is so strong that this egg should remain intact if I squeeze it equally from every direction. That's amazing, it actually won't break. If pressure is applied equally from all sides, even the world's strongest man couldn't break it. The shape simply disperses the force evenly across the shell, and it gets better. Although this shape can withstand a lot of compression, it's actually really weak in the opposite direction, so the chicks inside can break free. So for whatever reason eggs are egg-shaped, we should be grateful because they fit so perfectly into our egg cups. If you have any weird animal questions, then type them in the comment box below. See you next time on Zoo La La. They tend to roll around the inside of the... Of the they lay a long shaped egg. A long narrow egg. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> a long narrow egg. <laughs> well, what an incredible day we've had. From that phone call first thing this morning saying that Satami had finally given birth and that rush, mad dash up the motorway to be here to meet this amazing new addition to the herd.